picked these guys up at Steel City Con. This is the MicroMaster Autobot Off-Road Patrol. You've got Mudslinger, High Jump, Powertrain, and Tote. Tote's a goat. He is not a baby Ironhide. <clears throat> and they're just little... They're not quite Micro Machine size. They're a little bigger than Micro Machines, but these small little mini Transformers that came out uh, near the end of the G1 line. And uh, really kind of cool. I passed up on a baggie that had like seven or eight MicroMasters in it. That was 10 bucks because I was looking around the convention. And when I came back to get them, they were gone. But I found this whole set for 10 bucks, all four of them. And they're in really nice shape. So I went ahead and nabbed them. Um, and again, like I said, they're very simple to transform. They just basically flip out some parts. And I know they're easy because uh, we visited my uh, wife's 94-year-old grandmother. And she had a lot of fun playing with them. She uh, picked them out and enjoyed them. So they're not too difficult. So you just flip them around. Like I said, they're, they're simplistic. They're not the most amazing Transformers ever, but they're fun little toys. I really love Powertrain. One, I like orange, as I've mentioned before. And I don't know. He's a little semi-truck. I like him. I like, actually, I like just about everybody in this set. High jumps a little, but oh well. You have to flip this, and then you flip his arms down like that. And yeah, so high jumps a little iffy. His arms really don't reach past his stomach. Um, Mudslinger's pretty cool, except he, has a, he keeps the giant wheels in robot mode. But again, they're all very simple, very basic, but a lot of fun, and, and I'm glad I picked them up. I may pick up some more MicroMasters here. Uh, there were some that came with sets, you know, like Erector had the, just the one figure and then like a big trailer. Um, these came in packs of four. This is the Off-Road Patrol uh, from MicroMasters.